Oh God, cleanse me, sin and have mercy upon me. <clears throat> oh God, cleanse me, sin and have mercy upon me. Oh God, cleanse me, sin and have mercy upon me. Blessed is our God, who is now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, our God. Glory to thee. O heavenly King, the Comforter, the Spirit of Truth, who art everywhere and fullest all things, treasury of blessings, giver of life, come and abide, cleanse us from every impurity, and save our souls, O good one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord, cleanse us from our sins, O Master of our transgressions, O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship God our King. O come, let us worship and fall down for Christ our King and our God. O come, let us worship and fall down for Christ Himself our King and our God. Have mercy on me, O God, according to the great goodness, according to the abundant mercy, blood of my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin, for I know my transgression and sin is ever before me. Against thee only have I sinned and done evil in thy sight, so thou art justified in thy sentence and blameless in thy judgment. Behold, I was brought forth in iniquity and sin did my mother conceive me. Behold, thou desires truth in the inward being, therefore teach me wisdom in my secret heart. Purge me with this, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Fill me with joy and gladness, that the bones which I was broken rejoice. I lay face for my sins and blot out my iniquities. Create me a clean heart, O God, and put in a right spirit within me. Cast me not away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of salvation. Uphold me with thy willing spirit. Then I will teach transgressors thy ways, and sinners will return to thee. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation. My tongue will sing aloud of thy deliverance. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall show forth thy praise. For thou hast no delight in sacrifice. If I were to give a bird offering, thou would not be pleased. Be sacrifice acceptable to God as a broken spirit, a broken and contrite heart of God that is not despised. Do good and design and thy good pleasure, build the walls of Jerusalem, and then thou delight in right sacrifice, and burnt offerings, and hope and offerings. Thou laughing looks upon thine altar. <coughs> o chosen hierarch, most glorious favorite and confessor of Christ, strong defender of the Orthodox Church, intercessor and supplicant for both Russia and America, who glorify the Lord, who glorify thee by granting us such a great and new glorious witness. We sing this hymn of praise to thee as thou hast great boldness before the Queen of Heaven and Earth. Deliver us from all calamity who call to thee and sing. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, come, the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Desiring to comfort the people suffering through the turbulent and stormy days of revolution, the Lord and Creator of the angels gave them thee, O most serene and kind-hearted patriarch, to be the beacon illuminating the souls of the faithful with radiance of the thrice luminous trinity. And even now all those waiting to be with Christ follow thee in thy steps. Therefore we humbly sing. Rejoice, obedient monastic who accepted the patriarch's throne. Rejoice, elegant fulfillment of the will of God. Rejoice, O holy master who ascended the throne of the on the feast of the Virgin, rejoice, O good and faithful servant, who was announced before the throne of the Trinity on the feast of her Annunciation. Rejoice, confess, adorned with the robes of a patriarch. Rejoice, luminary, who dedicated his life to God and was illumined by him. Rejoice, confirmation of the patriarchate of the Russian Church. Rejoice, O blessed icon of the Good Shepherd. Rejoice, magnificent adornment of the Dunskoy Monastery. Rejoice, confirmation of the church in America. Rejoice, divinely ordained inheritance of the Russian lands. Rejoice, inspired instructor of the Orthodox in America. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, come the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. 
seeing the Russian people swarm, afraid and in great despair over the dis destruction of their Orthodox churches, thou didst prefer they should seek eternal life through prayer and supplication rather than through earthly death. Enlighten us also, tender-hearted Tikhon, with the light of thy wisdom, that together we may sing to the Creator of all. Alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. With wisdom inspired by God, O godly wise Tikhon, Thou didst deny the wisdom of the flesh, and didst wisely dedicate thy will to the Lord, offering thyself as a pure receptacle. Thou didst become an abode of the Holy Spirit. Therefore we pray thee as a godly, wise teacher, and we sing. Rejoice, great elder of the patriarchal throne, was foretold thee in the flower of thy youth. Rejoice, chosen labor of the vineyard of Christ. Rejoice, enlightened pastor of the, and nourisher of the Orthodox Church in America. Rejoice, good shepherd, whose flock clothe thee in the heights of spiritual deeds. Rejoice, good pastor, who leads his flock to salvation. Rejoice, champion of the kingdom on high. Rejoice, visionary of the, and preacher of the wisdom of God. Rejoice, guardian of the wisdom and the apostolic church. Rejoice, golden mouth, herald of orthodox truth. Rejoice, fearless exposer of lies and deceit. Rejoice, most wonderful fragrance of righteousness. Rejoice, O Master, who has not put our hopes to shame. Rejoice, O Holy Hierarchy, come the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. The power of God was, God was made manifest in thy cross-bearing labors, O preacher and hierarchy, come. For being armed with the grace of God, thou didst destroy the evil works of the countless enemies of orthodoxy, and didst sing to God the song of victory, Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Having unshakable faith and a conscience clear, thou didst forsake the comforts of this world, O Tikkun, blessed of God. And as a hierarch of the church, thou didst labor mightily for the Lord, Therefore, being adorned with blessedness and being illumined from on high, as the North Star, thou dost guide us all who sing. Rejoice, example of meekness, who love Christ with thy whole heart. Rejoice, wife, servant, who increased the talent entrusted to thee. Rejoice, O virtuous one, who accomplished things pleasing to God. Rejoice, invincible warrior, who armed thyself with wisdom, humility, and piety. Rejoice, Flodicum, whom confounded the godless and with holiness. Rejoice, O Master, who sought after righteousness with and truth. Rejoice, O Patriarch, who boldly proclaimed the truth. Rejoice, O Servant, who suffered imprisonment for the sake of the truth. Rejoice, O Monk, who attained the heights through humility. Rejoice, Great Ascetic, who achieved the eternal reward through thy spiritual deeds. Rejoice, Good Shepherd, who steadfastly ensured the safety of thy flock. Rejoice, O righteous one, who fervently entreated God for our sake. Rejoice, O holy heart, come the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. The raging storms of our passions filled thoughts do not allow us, O most wise Tikhon, to properly extol the magnitude of thy witness and confession, yet being strengthened in faith and piety through thy prayers before the throne of the Almighty. We fervently sing to him, Alleluia, 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 <coughs> Alleluia. When we, the faithful, learn of the beneficent goodness of thy soul, O God-bearing Tikkun, they were filled with the yearning desire to see thee ascend to the patriarchal throne. Since thou wast chosen from on high to be an instrument of divine command, we are filled with our with wonder at the providence of God, and we sing these songs of praise. Rejoice, chief hierarch elected by God. Rejoice, chosen man selected to lead the flock of Christ. Rejoice, divinely chosen of the high priest, Christ himself. Rejoice, confirmation of the eternal Christian ideals. Rejoice, communicant together with the apostles. Rejoice, celebrant of the great hierarchs of the church. Rejoice, godly wise, equal to the patriarchs of old. Rejoice, proven guide of the path of salvation. Rejoice, vanquisher of the logical of the flesh. Rejoice, ceaseless proclamation of salvific grace. 
Rejoice, ever-flowing source of miracles. Rejoice, supplicant of the people, starets and favorite of Russia. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, calm the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. The Lord revealed thee as a divinely bright star, O most wonderful Father Tika, and thou doth ever shine. Be upon thy flock with the radiant light of orthodoxy, revealing to us the steps which lead to the kingdom of heaven, and teaching us to sing to God, Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. When thou didst ascend to the throne of the patriarchal primacy, vacant for two hundred years, thou didst Give thyself completely to the Lord, and thou didst labor mightily for God, illuminating those darkened by their passions. Seeing thee, therefore, as a godly, wise archpastor, and most faithful and able builder of the house of God, we sing this hymn of praise. Rejoice from Pilate standing at the helm of the church. Rejoice, bright beacon of Christ to the faithful. Rejoice, provider of solace to those needing spiritual comfort. Rejoice, guardian of the church against the hour of thy death. Rejoice, great pastor who kept the devourer of souls from devouring thy flock. Rejoice, true helmsman who preserved the church of Christ in times of calamity. Rejoice, great leader who delivered us from the prince of this world. Rejoice, wise teacher who filled us with desire for Christ. Rejoice, beauty of theology and beauty in deeds. Rejoice, wisdom that confounded the fury of persecution. Rejoice, strength that streamed the temptations of the flesh. Rejoice, pride of the orthodox faith. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the orthodox faith. Truly thou didst appear as a preacher of God and bold defense and a righteous proclamation of the word of truth, O blessed hierarchy, on. For as a ch true soldier of Christ, Thou didst defend thy flock during the time of mortal sin and temptation, calling all to sing to the one true God, Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Having labored in the new world and having planted the foundations of monastic life in America, thou didst ascend the patriarchal throne of Russia as a radiant star, shimmering with the rays of thy teachings and dispelling the darkness of evil with the light of thy confession. Now we satisfy ourselves with the fruit of thy labors and with thankfulness and love we seen. Rejoice, O Hark, who ascended the throne of primacy through the providence of God. Rejoice, true pastor, who followed the way of the cross together with the flock entrusted to thee. Rejoice, loving Father, who led us with thy shepherd's staff. Rejoice, O Master, who did not abandon us in the wilderness. Rejoice, Good Shepherd, who returned the lost sheep, who was stolen away. Rejoice, Physician, who cared for the wounded and healed the sick. Rejoice, Vigilant Leader, who separated the rebellious and the violent from the lambs of thy flock. Rejoice, Confessor, who snatched the flow of heresies and malicious slander. Rejoice, Instructor of the faith who lamented strife in the church. Rejoice, O High Priest, who withstood false accusations against thy monastic life. Rejoice, precious treasure of the Church, who preserved the Orthodox faith as a treasure for all people. Rejoice, good worker in the vine, whose labor still shows us the way today. Rejoice, O Holy Hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Desiring ever to be good and shepherd to the flock, O God bearing Tikkun, thou didst strive to achieve all things for the benefit of thy souls, so they might come to the one true God. Therefore, we who desire to achieve salvation to thy most glorious intercession, dare to sing Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Church of both Russia and America has found in thee, O Holy Hierarchy, a new and glorious patron. For through thy confession as faith thou would didst withstand the assaults of men, while not forsaking the commands of the Holy Fathers. Therefore thou was given spiritual strength by the author of spiritual perfection, Christ himself and we, the unworthy seen. 
Rejoice, example of abstinence. Rejoice, source of salvation for countless souls. Rejoice, shepherd who drove the wolves away from my sheep. Rejoice, father who wisely exposed the treacherous ways. Rejoice, champion who defeated the satanic assaults. Rejoice, warrior who welded the, all the powerful weapon of grace. Rejoice, herald of God's providence for man. Rejoice, wonderful purification of morality. Rejoice, vigilant guardian of the treasures of the Orthodox faith. Rejoice, fulfillment of God's will, goodwill towards man. Rejoice, favorite of God, who tasted the pleasures of heaven while abiding here on earth. Rejoice, revelation of the sweetness of thy soul with the deeds of thy life. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, come the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. The unbelievers... And the weak in faith beheld a strange and glorious miracle. O God, please speak on when they witness thy blessed life on the patriarchal throne. For in the face of evil oppression, thou didst confirm the orthodox faith. And through thy wisdom and works of grace, thou didst teach us thy faithful flock to piously sing Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Being filled with love for Christ, O tender-hearted Tikhon, thou didst not abandon thy flock as a guardian angel. Thou didst offer prayers for them before the throne of the Almighty. Therefore, we fervently honor thy blessed memory as we sing these songs of praise. Rejoice, great master who astonished the world with thy love. Rejoice, example of meekness and authority. Rejoice, reflection of the glory of the glorious. O Lord of all, rejoice, bright beacon that shine the light of the kingdom upon us on earth. Rejoice, patient teacher of apostolic virtue. Rejoice, wise instructor in the canons of the church. Rejoice, good servant who preferred toil and labor over fame and honor. Rejoice, Pladico, whose words were based firmly in the orthodox truth. Rejoice, good teacher of priestly virtue. Rejoice, O master who accepted the heavenly Burden of the patriarchal throne, rejoice, precious gemstone that adorns the Russian and American lands. Rejoice, constant intercessor for us, thy helpless children before the throne of God. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. I'll inspire thyself to a glorious Podvig, the honorable Tikhon, and didst thereby achieve a great and eternal accomplishment. Thou didst establish thy grace, gracious and loving and God-loving soul into the life everlasting, where together with the heavenly host and the company of all the saints, thou didst sing to God the song of victory. Alleluia, 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 alleluia. The heralds of the times will never <clears throat> worthily proclaim the glorification of thy glorious memory, O Tikhon, the voice of God. We, however, being brought to repentance through thee, and fervently wishing to emulate thy humility, sing these songs of praise to thee. Rejoice, gracious teacher and master. Rejoice, that best defender of the weak in faith. Rejoice, fortress that withstood the soul, savagery of temporal power. Rejoice, O wise one who rendered to Caesar only that which was due to him. Rejoice, proclamation of the glory of the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Rejoice, preservation of the promise of salvation. Rejoice, zealous defender of the holy orthodox faith. Rejoice, blessed pathfinder along the way from earth to heaven. Rejoice, confirmation of the true faith amid the darkness of unrighteousness. Rejoice, deflector of the wrath of God, into mercy on our sinful souls. Rejoice, O patriarch of the great hierarchs of Moscow, did not abandon thee. Rejoice, O humble one, for thou art adorned with a protecting veil of thy most retail tokens. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, come the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Desiring to preserve the Russian church, O glorious Tikhon, thou didst bring anathema upon the bloodthirsty deeds of the lawless ones. By thus acting against the enemy of God, they came to fear thee as a second Hermogenes. 
But him, we who honor the blessed memory of thy suffering, sing to him who glorified thee. Alleluia. 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 By appearing as a steadfast and dependable luminary of the church, thou did shine forth as an image of a tireless warrior, striving valiantly in word and in deed, the defense of the true faith, O preacher and hierarch Tikhon, and even today the darkness is dispelled and the designs of the evil one are laid bare through the light of thy blessed counsels. Therefore we sing to thee, rejoice revelation of those espousing heresies, rejoice denunciation of the philosophy of godlessness, rejoice source of nourishment of the victims of persecution and the new martyrs of Russia, rejoice hope in the providence of God, Rejoice, new Peter, who accepted imprisonment for the sake of Christ. Rejoice, new Paul, who emulated Christ and his voluntary suffering. Rejoice, new Andrew, who joyfully accepted to suffer for Christ and his church. Rejoice, new John, who sufferings confirm thy confession. Rejoice, new Philip, who exposed the temptations of power and avarice. Rejoice, new Jonah, who brought fear to the minds of the faithless. Rejoice, new Alexis, who confirmed the true faith. Through thy many works, rejoice, new Peter, who nourished the newly planted vine in thy loving care. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Thou didst shine forth in heaven, O friend of Christ, adorned with a beautiful crown, and we on earth offer thee our songs of praise. For as the faithful hierarch thou hast robbed thyself, with truth, and now doth exalt in the sweetness of heaven. Earnestly pray for us before the Heavenly Father, as we glorify thee and sing to him, Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Christ revealed thee as a luminary for the entire world, the divinely inspired Father Tika. For he beheld the, the humility of thy heart and placed thee on a, the patriarchal throne. Presenting thyself to him as a sweet-smelling offering, thou didst become both priest and sacrifice. For this cause we offer thee our ceaseless, ceaseless song of praise. Rejoice, radiant icon of the beauty of thy life. Rejoice, faithful servant, who worthily receives eternal life. Rejoice, powerful defender of truth. Rejoice, earnest proponent of repentance. Rejoice, destroyer of the evil intentions of the wicked. Rejoice, strengthen, strengthener of the weak of the orthodox faith. Rejoice, willing prisoner for the sake of the faith. Rejoice, passion bearer who willingly endured torture for the sake of Christ. Rejoice, proven weapon of the power of God. Rejoice, holy temple dedicated to the glory of God. Rejoice, blessed shepherd dedicated to the spiritual safety of thy flock. Rejoice, speedy helper to those who call upon thee. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, con, the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Desiring to receive grace from the bountiful Lord of all, thou didst adorn thy life as with a garment free of every stain of sin. O all praise, Father Tikhon, teaching us all to humbly venerate Christ. In return, he adorned thee with the gift of miracles and sanctified and glorified thee both in heaven and on earth teaching us to sing to thee, Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. As we glorify the confessor's crown which thou didst receive, O most wonderful Tikkun, we find ourselves unable to praise thee worthily. For what shall we call thee through whom God glorified in the Trinity hath glorified himself? Therefore we sing to thee these songs of praise. Rejoice, O Father, whose cross-bearing labors were pleasing to the Lord. Rejoice, O Master, who sought only to do the will of God. Rejoice, O Vessel, overflowing with the Holy Spirit. Rejoice, O Blessed Child, is filled with the, His holy gifts. Rejoice, O Honored One, who received the eternal blessings of God. Rejoice, O Intercessor, who entreats God's blessing on thy people. Rejoice, O Physician, whose healing relics appeared as a flame of fire. Rejoice, precious dew, for through thee was the Holy Church preserved as from fire. Rejoice, fervent champion of the glory of God. Rejoice, steadfast protector of speedy answers to our prayers. 
Rejoice, source of joy and gladness for thy flock. Rejoice, humble servant, who dedicated thy life to serving the Orthodox faith. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. O most gracious pastor, holy <clears throat> patriarch, keep on accept these are humble praises and pray to the Lord of hosts who have crowned thee with glory. Thy, that Russia might arise in Christ, and that the people of his holy church might live in peace, protected from all spiritual maladies and godless turmoil, that the hearts of all mankind may become filled with love of him and towards their neighbor, and those who have fallen away or have never been taught might come to know him through the power of his good and holy spirit, that we may now and ever and unto ages of ages with one heart and with one mind sing unto him Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. O most gracious pastor, holy patriarch, and accept these our humble praises and pray to the Lord of hosts who hath crowned thee with glory, that Russia might arise in Christ and that the people of his holy church might live in peace protected from all spiritual maladies and godless turmoil, that the hearts of all mankind may become filled with love for him and towards their neighbors, that those who have fallen away or have been taught might come to know him through the power of his good and Holy Spirit, and that we might now and ever and unto ages of ages with one heart and with one mind sing unto him Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. O most gracious pastor, holy patriarch, he can accept these our humble praises and pray to the Lord of hosts who have crowned thee with glory, that Russia might arise in Christ, that the people of his holy church might live in peace, protected from all spiritual maladies and godless turmoil, that the hearts of all mankind may become filled with the love of him, and towards their neighbor and those who have fallen away or have never been taught might come to know him through the power of his good and Holy Spirit, and that we may now and ever and unto ages of ages with one heart and with one mind sing unto him, Alleluia, 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 Alleluia. Desiring to comfort the people suffering through the turbulent and stormy days of revolution, the Lord and Creator of angels gave them the O most serene and kind-hearted patriarch, to be a beacon illuminating the souls of faith with the radiance of the thrice luminous Trinity. And now all those wanting to be with Christ follow thee in thy steps. Therefore we humbly sing. Rejoice, obedient to monastic who accepted the patriarch's throne. Rejoice, zealous fulfillment of the will of God. Rejoice, all holy master who ascended the throne of the feast of the Virgin. Rejoice, O good one, unfaithful servant, who was announced before the throne of the Trinity on the feast of her Annunciation. Rejoice, confessor adorned in the robes of the patriarch. Rejoice, luminary, who dedicated his life to God and was illumined by him. Rejoice, confirmation of the patriarch of the Russian Church. Rejoice, O blessed icon of the Good Shepherd. Rejoice, magnificent adornment of the Dunskoy Monastery. Rejoice, confirmation of the Church in America. Rejoice, divinely ordained inheritance of the Russian lands. Rejoice, divinely inspired instructor of the Orthodox Church in America. Rejoice, O holy hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. O chosen hierarch, most glorious, favored, and confessor of Christ, strong defender of the Orthodox Church, intercessor and supplicant for both Russia and America, who glorify the Lord, who glorify thee by granting us such a great and new and glorious witness. We sing this hymn of praise to thee, as thou hast great boldness before the Queen of Heaven and Earth. Deliver us from all calamity, who call to thee and and sing, Rejoice, O Holy Hierarchy, on the pride and confirmation of the Orthodox Church. Again and again, on bended knees, let us pray to the Holy, our Holy Hierarchy, on <clears throat> O Holy Hierarchy, on pray to God for us. O most gracious Pastor, great and holy Patriarch, on 
but it appears a fortress standing high atop a hill, and thy many good deeds shine forth before us even to this day. And now standing before the throne of the most holy trinity, thou dost ever pray with great boldness to the Lord and creator of all. Look down upon thy sinful and unworthy servants, children who have fallen down before thee in earnest. Pray and entreat the Lord that he may grant us the determination to firmly strive in faith in our fathers. Thou hadst firmly strive in the days of thy youth. And having been an adder and defender and protector of the true faith during this life, help us to preserve the orthodox faith. Seeing before us the calm and serene example of thy peaceful soul, enable us to humbly accept the will of God rather than be concerned with the temptations wisdom of man. Bravely thou didst stand before the enemies of Christ, boldly proclaiming the one true God. Strengthen us weaklings, therefore, with thy prayers, that we too may in every place and every time stand against the forces of atheism and lies. O champion of Christ, do not despise us as we bring our prayers to thee. For not only are we asking of deliverance from our sorrows and misfortunes, we are also asking for strength and determination and the spirit of love and grace that we might overcome all the perils that befall us. Pray that we may grant them, be granted the required patience to reach the end of our days, that we may attain the peace of our Lord and that we may receive remission of our sins. O Holy Father Tikhon, disperse the winds of strife and faithlessness, so that our Lord may establish the peaceful calm of faith and uncompromised love in all the Russian and American lands, that civil strife and discord may be, a, a, may be, may be abandoned through thy prayers, and that our Holy Orthodox Church may flourish, never wanting for honest workers or true pastors to rightly divide the word of thy truth, protect and preserve the flock of Christ, and ceaselessly entreat the Lord of hosts that our lands will embrace the spirit of repentance, that we may all with one mind and one heart ever praise God, who is wonderful in his saints, the Trinity, glorified in the Father and in the Son and the Holy Spirit, always, now, and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Wisdom, most holy Theotokos, save us. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Without corruption, thou gavest birth to God the Word. True Theotokos, we magnify thee. Glory to thee, O Christ our God, and our hope. Glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. May Christ, our true God, through the prayers of his most pure mother, of the holy, glorious prophet, forerunner, and Baptist John, the holy, glorious, and all audible apostles, and of the holy confessor, patriarch of Moscow, and all Russian, lightener of North America, Tikhon, who we commemorate today, and of the holy, righteous ancestors of God, Joachim, and Anna, of all the saints, have mercy and save us for as much as he is good and loves mankind. Amen.